Oh, welcome back to the channel. Now I gotta push my wife home. Cause as we was coming out the highway, she was losing power. And the car, as she was coming up off, it was steady losing power. And she uh pulled over and it shut off on her and it won't start up now. And my baby's in the car. Now this is one thing I don't fuck around with. A cut cut out on 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 with my baby in it, with my girls in it. That's a no go. Even when I had that Dodge and Trapper back in 2013, it was just me and my lady then, and we ain't even had a baby yet. It was just me and my lady. That motherfucker started smoking and and it cut off on us. Yeah, I could have fixed it, but I said fuck that. I junked it. And this one, the crankshaft sensor might have went. I don't know yet. But look into it tomorrow, but I, I'm really thinking about just getting rid of this motherfucker. You know, that's what I'm really thinking about. I'm thinking, yeah, because uh, she's still paying a car note on this motherfucker. And the, the car lot that she got it from, they done went out of business. So it ain't no calling them and none of that shit. I'm glad that's why I came with her tonight. Well, I guess we're gonna probably be doing Uber Eats in my car. Just gotta watch out for the law. I gave her enough rolling power. Why she go this way? She know the police might be down here. Okay, let me creep up on her because I just kind of hit her collar too hard. <sighs> what a fucking night. Fucking cars, bro. Fucking cars. <laughs> 